I've often said that if you want to see what a complete absence of character looks like, peer into the soul of a thief. It just escapes a reasonable man's logic when we try to imagine what could possibly be going on inside the mind of a man who would creep around somebody else's house, wait for them to leave, then kick in the door and steal their personal belongings. The man who owns this camp on Collins Lane in Opelousas had it set up pretty nice. He had worked on it for years, bit by bit, as he could afford it. One weekend recently, he was startled to discover that thieves had cleaned him out. They stole two large flat screens, his guns, his fishing poles and tackle, his kids' video games and console. They even took a collection of model cars, an old brass diving helmet, and his whirlpool dryer. Unbelievable. If you're the parasite that did this, hear me good. You make decent folks sick. You're like a disease, a cancer on society. You'll never amount to anything. You have zero to offer the world, and you're bound for hell. If we have anything to do with it, we'll introduce you to serious penance before you reach your ultimate and appropriate demise. What will you do with this good man's belongings? Will you give stolen model cars to your unfortunate seed to play with? Will you eat fish caught with stolen gear? And what would someone like you even want with a dryer? We all know you don't even wash proper, much less launder your clothes. Here's my promise to you. We will identify you, arrest you, and put you in our smallest cell. Unless you get caught crawling through the wrong window. If that happens, wouldn't that be tragic? On behalf of Crime Stoppers, I'm Captain Clay Higgins. If you have any information on this crime, call Crime Stoppers at 948-TIPS. You could earn up to a $1,000 cash reward.